We're here today at General Fabrication. It's a uh, booth fabrication company. We do product displays, uh, exhibit booths, double decks. We usually go to like SEMA, CES, and you see a lot of big metal displays. A good majority of that is actually our work. Cassie's helping us today with the intercooler and tanks. I tack everything together to make sure that we get the overall shape and then I fit it to the intercooler core. They utilize you know, CAD design, they have a table cutter, they have a blast cab and everything that we need to kind of get the car in that final stage. They have the resources, they have the talent, they have the time and they have the space to allow me to work on the project here. So we're doing two things today. Rainier from Race Factory is also here helping us cut our fiberglass. Nick's been working on this coop since freaking who knows how long, a long time now. He's buying the parts, high quality Japanese parts that are, you know, fit grade A and he's, his car has been clean since the day he bought it. In order to put all these parts together, all the edges kind of need to get smoothed up and trimmed down to like fit over the eight pillars and wrap around the bottom of the rocker panel properly. For uh, Nick's application, he wanted to run it more simple style, like streetcar. The number one thing to get right the first time is hood alignment, because you're pretty much building headlights, bumper, and the fenders off of your hood. So as straight as you can get hood to the chassis, and then build off of that, then you run into less problems, I feel. Because the hood pin will allow it to sit up higher, right? Yeah. Ray's the best at what he does. Two, perfect. Maybe actually close it. All this. Ray has been fitting aero on cars, on style cars, and the fitment that he gets, the way he's able to manipulate the fiberglass, the way he's able to, you know, get things that may not necessarily be perfect look perfect. That's the reason why we're working on, on this project it's together. Worse. It's totally worse <laughs> than the weight. It's probably not gonna fit with these OEM brackets anyway. So let's go grab him real quick. Cassie did a great job welding the intercooler uh, end tanks. Thank you Cassie for making that happen. Uh, we got the piping run, everything is running well. We got the intercooler mid-mounted high. Uh, right now Ray Near is working on kind of lining up the fenders a little better. I need to give him a hand with that. We got the rear quarter panels uh, mounted. Doors are good, hood's good, bumpers are good, but we still have to get these fenders going. So uh, you know, thank you Cassidy, and I gotta give Ray a hand. <laughs>